Battle of Seven. My name is Butch, named after famous American pasta western actor Butch Cassidy. I am coach of Alexi Do. Mom. Trubisky, and welcome to my. She's not here. I see you haven't moved since the beginning of the semester. And I see you've added the sophomore 16 to the freshman 15. Clever. Have you been rehearsing that? <laughs> Only a little. Yeah, I've heard better. It's not my greatest work, no. Seriously, where is Mom? I don't know, she's at Grandma's or something. It's just you and me, Hermana. But she knew I was coming home this weekend. What's a big deal? I told her I'd clean out the attic. <laughs> Why would you do that? I was being nice. I don't think she'd want to go through Aunt Judy's stuff all by herself. I wouldn't touch that stuff if I were you. STDs much? <laughs> Have some respect. I'm sorry, Aunt Judy. Will you please forgive me? Yeah, she told me to fuck off. You're a horrible human being. <laughs> you know that, right? Yeah, yeah. Joe, best friend, you wouldn't want to help me clean out the attic, would you? Please? Yeah, right. I'll make you grilled cheese. With bacon? Of course. Fine. Glad to see you dressed up for the occasion. Glad to see Grandpa's sweater still fit. This is from the Gap. I can't believe Mom totally stuck me with this. Did she even ask you to help? Nope. Guess she likes me best. Or she's seen your room and she knows that you're physically incapable of cleaning. I can't clean. <laughs> this sucks. Yeah. My Barbies! Oh, I can't believe Mom kept these! Yeah, I thought she got rid of them after you ripped the head off my Dorothy and almost choked to death on her hairbrush. Oh, yes. The great Dorothy debacle of 01. I remember it fondly. It's workout, Barbie. <laughs> oh, Karen! <laughs> so, how's school? Fine. You know, the usual. Actually, I really don't. You hardly talk to me. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just surprised you came back at all. I was gone a semester. No, you stayed the summer too. Fine, one summer. It's not a big deal. Mr. Snuggles! I totally thought I lost him when we moved. You're gonna stay with me, buddy. No more attic slumber parties for you. Does this not even work? Joe, can we focus? <laughs> can we focus, please? Yes, yes. Um, so what exactly are we keeping? I don't know. Mom just wanted it gone. I guess anything that seems important we'll keep. Like this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that can go. What is this? <laughs> I have no idea. So, are you really pissed at me about this summer? <laughs> well, yeah, kind of. I mean, you kind of stuck me here with Mom. You pretty much left as soon as the funeral was over. I know, but I really had to get out of here. 
And I didn't. Yeah, but you didn't know how screwed up everything was. What are you talking about? Are you keeping any of those? Do we even have a record player? I don't think so. <laughs> then nope. Dazzle them. Anything good? Uh, I don't know yet. Looks like a bunch of junk to me. What's she doing with a crusty dude watch? She used to take me to garage sales and she'd buy all this junk that she was gonna fix up. Still looks broken to me. Yeah, she never really got around to it. Oh, this is pretty. Do you want it? Um, why would I want it? I had like two actual conversations with Aunt Judy and I'm pretty sure she was fucked up for both of them. Okay. She was such a waste case, you know? I can't believe they were sisters. She wasn't that bad. She was that bad. Oh, I haven't seen these since the funeral. Uh, when was she ever at Christmas? I think you were too little then. Oh, I like this one. She looks totally different. Yeah, I know. She kind of looks like shit. It's the only one I have of her that's kind of recent. She doesn't look that bad. She just hit the crack pipe about 20 minutes before that was taken. Guaranteed. <laughs> it's terrible. I'm a realist. Oh, good God. <laughs> When was this ever cool? I would have a drug problem too if I had to wear this to prom. Was she igloo shaped or something? It's not funny. <laughs> Bitch killed Elmo! Oh, I can't. I can't. Just put it away. Aw, someone's just jealous I got to it first. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Just be careful with it, okay? Who cares about some stupid dress? She's fucking dead anyways. You're horrible. I'm horrible? I'm not the one that screwed her up. Whatever, she was a really shitty aunt anyways. I don't really care. You don't mean that. Of course I do. I never liked her. Who do you like? Um, plenty of people. Not that you would know since we haven't talked in months. Why do you care so much? I just don't think it's fair for you to be so critical of her. I mean, you have no right to judge her. I don't care about her, okay? Didn't even know her, so just back off. Jesus, I liked you better when you were gone. Well, maybe I liked it better that way, too. <sighs> this stuff is disgusting. Joe. I need to tell you something. Mel, I'm really not in the mood for you starting some bullshit heart-to-heart. -heart. Will you just listen to me? Just shut up, Mel! Okay? I'm trying to do this for you! I, I never get to see you anymore and you're still a bitch to me! Why do you hate me so much? You're my fucking sister! No, I'm not. Shit, I didn't mean it like that. Of course you're my sister. I don't care that we're not. What? I wasn't supposed to tell you. I... Mom was going to tell you when you turned 12, and then she didn't think that you were ready. And then when you were 16, she still couldn't. And then after the funeral, we didn't know how to tell you. I'm sorry, Joe. The fuck off, Mel. This isn't funny. I'm sorry. We just didn't know how to tell you. It got so much harder after Aunt Judy started using again. So, Aunt Judy? <laughs> you're joking, right? Mel, if you're messing with me, I swear, I'm gonna... I'm sorry. We just didn't want to upset you. Uh, so you wait till now? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm sorry. I didn't know what to do. So you wait till she's dead? She's fucking gone! I 
I, ha I have to clean this up. Joe. Joe, talk to me. Please. How could you not tell me? How long did you know? It wasn't easy for me. I wanted to tell you, I promise. I guess it just slipped your mind while you're pretending to be my sister. That's bullshit. I never treated you differently because of that. I'm sorry. I guess... I just didn't want you to hate me. No. So you let me hate her instead. I'm sorry, that's not what I wanted. Guys, I'm home. Mel, where are you? Thank you.